House for you this evening. Terminally ill patients will soon have the chance to try experimental drugs in their treatment. Governor Pence has signed the Right to Try bill into law. Indiana is the ninth state to pass Right to Try. RTV6 State House reporter Katie Hines is live now with details. Katie. Hi, Governor Pence says that he hopes this bill will, or now law, will pave the way for a pathway for Hoosiers to have healing for many years to come. He had signed the bill earlier today, and the law gives terminally ill patients the opportunity to try drugs that have cleared the first phase of the FDA approval process but are still in the experimental stage. Five year old Jordan McClinn stood by the governor's side as he signed the bill into law. The honorary Indianapolis firefighter suffers from Duchenne muscular dystrophy. His life expectancy is 20. His mother, Laura, testified in support of the measure during recent hearings. She's optimistic an experimental drug could slow the progression of her son's disease. We do have a lot of hope that Jordan is going to benefit from Right to Try. I mean, that, that was the goal from the beginning. So now we have more steps ahead of us. Um, and they might not be as fun and easy as these were, but um, we're not going to stop. And under the new law, health care providers won't be liable if one of those experimental drugs results in any harm to anyone who tries them. But the House and Senate approved the proposal unanimously, although one lawmaker questioned how the state will track the efficiency of this process. Reporting live at the State House, Katie Hines, RTV6. A big relief for many, Katie. Thank you.